these astronauts aren't walking on the moon or at Cape Canaveral or even Johnson Space Center in Houston. They're actually at the off-road vehicle park in Moses Lake. To develop an infrastructure of rockets and spacecraft and support systems that will help us go to the moon and go on to other destinations in our solar system. Keep going, in about another 20 meters we'll start driving. NASA has brought dozens of people uh, here to test prototype vehicles that will eventually be used on the moon. The park's sandy terrain mirrors the lunar surface. There's no plant life, there are steep inclines, and the ground ranges from soft to firm footing. This truck, this truck is a lessons learned from Sojourner and, and Spirit Opportunity, the LRV that flew in, that flew in Apollo, and also trucks here on Earth. Testing began two weeks ago. The vehicles include the athlete, the six-wheeled rover that can roll or walk over extremely rough or steep terrain. The chariot can carry up to four people. Made out of chromium, it serves many critical functions. Chariot can do things similar to trucks on Earth. Uh, it, can, it can transport people, it can transport payload, it can also, we put uh, implements on the front of it that can bulldoze. Scientists are tracking every movement these vehicles make. Researchers will later determine what changes and modifications are needed. NASA's ultimate goal, building an outpost on the moon where humans can live for up to six months. In Moses Lake, Hao Kwong, CAP, KVU Local News.